My name's John Hutchison. I uh, landed in Everton in 1971. Immediately it was the place I wanted to, um, to live and work. Uh, and that's roughly what I've done for the last 40 odd years. I now do a bit for the Shrewsbury Club um, and the Friends of Everton Park. I, I got a, a job in the Shrewsy in 1976 and uh, worked there as the um, full-time youth worker till the end of the 80s. And that was just a fantastic privilege. Uh, Kids were wonderful, it was tough times, and the housing in particular uh, was really beginning to deteriorate already. The high rise that had populated the area, something like 25 high rise blocks, I think, and the low rise stuff on Arkwright Street, which is a real catchment for the Shoesy, uh, was falling apart. And um, by the end of the 80s or mid 80s, um, there was proposals from the council to basically blitz the whole area. And the response to that from the community uh, was quite angry. It was quite clear that, look, we do want improved houses, but we do not want to lose the community, this great community with great people, uh, great resilience. And that led to uh, quite a standoff. And uh, we ended up in court with the council. Uh, we ended up squatting a property in Langrove Street for four months. And that was a great piece of community action. And uh, that typified, I think, um, the, you know, the talent and resilience, as I say, and determination of the community to stay together and rebuild um, what was um, the tribe of Everton, and still was, and still is. Um, so the lost tribe spread to all corners, uh, didn't vanish. Uh, and we've rebuilt, um, through a load of people's efforts over the years, uh, really good quality housing across the area. The park is... Um, is uh, Everton Park with, with its eye over the city, the vista over the, uh, the World Heritage Site is, is a real feature for us now. We're trying hard to uh, refurbish that and bring it up to a real high standard. We've got a lot of people involved in that. We do events every year. Uh, and the housing's great too. There's some threats to the housing quality overall, just with um, uh, private development and speculative development, which is um, building up again, building high rise stuff again. And we don't want to go back to that nightmare. There's plenty of good reasons why uh, more housing is needed in and around the area, but we want quality, and that's what the people here uh, deserve. It's got itself back off its knees onto its feet, the community, uh, and I hope that's the way it goes uh, in the future. This project is going to help that happen because we'll look back and treasure those real great things from the community, the great hallmarks of the community and the people, and way up the present and build for the future. Um, so, Lost Tribes of Everton, roll on.